it's Sean Beasley, and I'd like to welcome you to this quick screencast about navigating within the Safari browser. Now, this, uh, this Safari browser is on macOS Mountain Lion, OS X Mountain Lion, and I'm using the browser 6.0.3. The tips that I want to show you are about navigating through tabs. And they seem to only apply to the Safari version 6 and to the uh, Mac OS X 10.8. Mileage may vary. So, uh, you have the ability in most of the, or in all of the major browsers in the meantime, to work with tabs so that when you're perusing around Apple's website, for example, um, and you want to go to the Mac section, but you want to leave, for some reason, the other window open, then you can um, <clears throat> control click or then you can control click and go to open link in new tab or you can right click if you've got your mouse set up for right click and you'll open up another tab and in this tab you'll see the uh, MacBook Pro for example or if we want to open up the iPhone then we'll control click and open up the iPhone. Um, and that's one way to get these tabs open. Um, once you've got a bunch of tabs open though, it can tend to be confusing uh, where you're at or, or you might want to get somewhere, uh, get back to one of your other tabs. Now what you can do of course is you can go down here, you can find your mouse wherever it's running around. I'm a little bit colorblind and uh, tend to lose my mouse a lot so I, I like to stick to keyboard commands when possible. Uh, once you found your mouse, you can go up here and you can look. Mm, Apple Mac, Apple, Mayor Uber Apps. What? Uh, that wasn't the uh, that wasn't the side. I'm mean, I'm on the German website because I'm in German uh, IP base. And so here I'm bobbing around. Oh, there it is. There's the main screen. That's one thing you can do. The other thing you can do is use your keyboard. You can use Command Shift. If you use Command Shift, then you can go one tab at a time to get to the screen you want to go to. That's also good, but you have to go through all of the screens to get to where you want to go. So you have to cycle through each screen. You may not want to do that. Um, what else can we do? Well, if I want to go back to using the mouse, and my mouse just happens to be there and conveniently uh, where I'm at, I might be using my mouse to click on something and I want to go back and reference something else. And if you have a trackpad, or you're using the track, uh, magic trackpad, or if you're using the trackpad on your laptop. I'm not sure if it works with the magic mouse preferences pane, because I don't use my magic mouse anymore. Then you can use a two-finger pinch, and when you pinch the screen, you see that it goes into a tab overview. Now you can use two-finger swipes, left and right, to get to where you want to go. So, using the pinch I can get to anywhere I want to go, but what happens if you don't have a magic trackpad, or if you're not using the trackpad? Well, you also have a key combination, and that's command, shift, backslash. This has the added advantage of speed, so here I'm getting the preview, and I can get to where I want to go also using the left and right mouse, uh, the left and right arrow buttons. So here we've got a lot of different ways using the space button or the enter button. I can get back to where I want it to be, or I can load the page I want it to be. I may actually um, want to use this view to go back and get some short information if I'm filling out a web form or something, and then go back to the web form and continue to fill out the information that I had. So just using that key combination, getting over the chart, looking at what I need to look at, and then pressing the space button to continue. I find it to be interesting, it might just be a little bit of eye candy, whatever, but um, I wanted to show you guys what you could do in combination with hotkeys and the trackpad on your notebook or the magic trackpad in order to make your browsing experience a little bit more interesting and quite possibly more efficient uh, on the Safari web browser. Thank you for watching, subscribe if you like, uh, share my videos and have a great day.